kitty on the farm. Once, on a farm in the country, there lived a little boy who was given a brand new kitty to be his very own. But she had no name, and the little boy didn't know what to call her. So he went to his mother and asked, Mother, what shall I call my kitty? His mother was busy making a cake, and she gave the boy the spoon to lick. Why don't you call her Tiger? Oh no, said the little boy. I can't call her Tiger. She's not that big. So he went to find his father. Father, he asked, what shall I call my kitty? His father was busy mending a fence, and he gave the little boy a hammer to hold while he put a board in place. Why don't you call her Shoe Leather? Because she's bound to be always underfoot. Oh no, cried the little boy, that name's too long. So he turned back to the house to find his grandfather. His grandfather was sitting on the porch, and he wasn't busy at all. Grandfather, asked the little boy, what shall I call my kitty? Wait a jiffy, until I get my thinking cap, said his grandfather. And he went inside to get his bright red thinking cap. Why don't you call her Joseph? because she has a coat of many colors. But Joseph is a boy's name, and this is a girl kitty, said the little boy. The little boy wandered back down the path. If my mother doesn't know, and my father doesn't know, and neither does my grandfather, the little boy said to himself, perhaps I should find out from the animals on the farm. So he went to the stile, and he climbed right over, and he asked of the cow who was nibbling at the clover, Cow, what shall I call my kitty? Moo, lowed the cow, shaking her horn at a butterfly. Moo, 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 said the little boy. That's no name for a kitty. So he hurried to the barnyard as fast as he was able, and he asked of the horse, at dinner in the stable. Horse, what shall I call my kitty? Nay, went he the horse, politely, looking up from his oats. Nay, 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 exclaimed the little boy. That's no name for a kitty. So he walked by the garden, all alone, and he asked of the dog who was burying a bone. Dog, what shall I call my kitty? The dog stopped scraping for a minute. Bow wow, bow wow wow, he barked. Bow wow, bow wow indeed, cried the little boy crossly. That's no name at all for a kitty. So he crossed the pasture to the hill below, and he asked of the sheep who were grazing in a row. Sheep, what shall I call my kitty? Ba, bleated the sheep all raising their heads in the same direction at the same time. Bah! Bah! sighed the little boy. I might have known. That's no name for a kitty. So he went to the chickens to try his luck, but the chick said peep and the hen said cluck. And quack said the duck when he asked the duck, And the pig just grunted as if he hadn't heard. And the fish in the pond didn't say a word. So the little boy sat down sadly on the back store step in the sunlight and put his chin in his hand. And he thought, and he thought, and he thought. The kitty chased the sunbeam and purred. Kitty, murmured the little boy. Nice kitty. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. And then all of a sudden he jumped up. I know, he shouted happily. I know what I'll call my kitty. I'll call her Kitty. And he did. <laughs>